Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we will try to learn some other, some more navigation guides about the route navigation guides. What I have left out in the previous video, we will try to learn in this video. Okay. The most important thing, so what we need to learn about this one is, what I can tell is before route update. What is this before route update? So if I try to write here before route update, okay. So same thing before route update, before route update, okay. So these are all component based updates only. So you don't have these all globally, you don't have. So these are component based only. Before route leave, before route update, these things. So before route update, let's try to print console.log <coughs> before route update. Okay. So if I try to post in the post I have written, right? So if I try to check the output here, if I try to refresh here, so now nothing will be fired. So if I go to create post. So before route update is not firing if i come to post here so before route update is not firing okay so what so here in this post it is not firing so now we need to check in the post item so now you will be able to understand the difference the post item if i try to paste it here okay before route update in the post item so now here if you write this one now if we, if we click on the show details now here you will be able to see that before route update see okay so now if I click here, okay, now if I click here, if I click here, okay, now you will be able not able to see anything. Now if I click on the show details, okay, you will be able to see the before route update here and also the before route update in the post item. Now you are able to see both the things. So the things what will happen is, for example, if you are, if you are in the same component, okay, if you are in the same component, but the URL routing is changing. So you are in the same component but when the url is changing you are in the same component right so in this scenario so route route has been updated but you are in the same route but the route has been updated so in those scenarios you will be you will be executing this before route update in the post item okay so now here the component here the component we are having the same thing component we are having the same component only but what is the thing we are having we have updated the route so post has been updated to post slash something and here also the number has also been changed Okay, so for this type of scenarios, so we will be executing before route update in the post before route update. So this one will be executing whenever the route, the same component route, when we are updating the uh, URL, then we will be getting the where uh, then this route update will be triggered. So where we will be using this one is so for example, you are in the same uh, same component, same items, post ID if it is changing means this route update will be very useful. And another thing also you need to remember that before route enter, if you go to the post item before route enter is there right so that means route has not been entered up to now okay so that means the instance will not be available here so if you want to make use of this instance for example here you have a uh, high variable okay high variable you have let's assume so if, if you want to access this one way how you can access directly this dot high you can access like this right so you if you want to access here in the before route enter console dot log this dot high if you want to access like this this dot high you will be not able to access this one. Why? Because the route has not been entered. So now here if I go to create post and if I click on this one, so you will be able to get an error that cannot read property high of null. Why this error is coming? Because the route has not been instantiated before route enter. The name itself indicates that the route before entering, before instantiating, this one will execute. So that is the reason this will not be available. So in order to avail, in order to make use of this, this variable, how we need to use is so here we need to write okay to to comma from comma i already told you that before route enter you will be having third parameter next parameter using the next parameter what it will do so the next parameter will take the instance okay it's a promise function and vm will be nothing but the so when this all been instantiated this method will be executed okay when this root is instantiated instantiated this method will be executed and this vm is nothing but the instance of this component so now here you can access console.log vm dot high okay we will try to see here so to and from is not existing right so now if we try to see the output if i try to refresh here okay now if i go to the post now here you will be able to see the high c now here you are able to see the high okay so now in this way we will be making use of the this variable in the before root enter so these are all the complete navigation guards in the U router. So we have seen before enter, before each, before route enter, before route update, before route leave, 
and after each also we have seen okay so these are all the routing navigation right routing navigation cards in the UJS. if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you